is welcome back to World Illuminator 11. If you are new to the channel, a really warm welcome to you. I hope you're having a wonderful weekend. So I am sitting here reading my book and I just keep getting this message coming in about some messages from Divine Masculine. So there's a Divine Masculine out there or Divine Masculines out there who are wanting to share some messages with their Divine Feminine. So we're bringing in the unspoken messages from Divine Masculine to see what's coming through today, what they're wanting to say to you. And as always, take what resonates and leave what doesn't. These are all messages for the collective, including the shorts that I do. So sometimes messages may not be for you. If it doesn't resonate in your heart, let it go. And, you know, even parts of a reading or, you know, may not, or one card in a short may not be a message for you and the other one may be. Just always listen to your heart. Come from the heart always and take what resonates in your heart. Those will be messages for you. So thank you, angels. What does the Divine Masculine want to say? What messages are coming through? Uh, what is coming through? So we've got this one here. We'll just do them as they come out, actually. I miss you so much. So they are wanting you to know that they are missing you. They are thinking about you. They are missing you. That's why I kept getting that, you know. That's the first card coming through. I miss you so much. So at this time, they want you to know that they are missing you. And then we also have here, I feel this much in separation. What will I feel in union? I'm scared. So they're saying to you, you know, during this time that you are apart, they feel so much. They feel your energy. You know, they feel the power of the connection. They feel the love and everything that they've never felt before when it comes to this connection that they have with you. And they're saying to you, I feel so much. You know, when we are in physical separation, what will it be like? How will it feel in union? And they're saying to you, I'm scared. So they are thinking about the power of this connection as well. And that's what they are saying. And then the next message they have for you is, I love you, baby. That's what that is. I love you, baby. That's what's coming through to me. So they're saying to you, I love you, baby. So they're saying, I miss you so much. And I love you, baby. That's what's come through. So they are letting you know that they miss you and they love you. And that's what they're wanting you to know today. And they are also saying to you, I'm absolutely coming back for you. So they're letting you know that they are coming back for you. You know, they want this life with you. And they're saying, I am absolutely coming back for you. So it's something that they want and something that they're working towards as well to have this life with you. Because they're saying to you, I love you, baby. And I am absolutely coming back for you. So this one as well. I don't know how much longer I can fight. So they're also saying to you, you know, I feel that in the situation that they're in, you know, they may be in a situation, a comic situation, things going on in their life where sometimes it's all just a bit too much. And they're saying, I don't know how much I can keep fighting in this situation with the people that are in their life at this time. They want to change. That's what I'm really feeling here. So they're saying to you, I don't know how much I can, how longer I can fight, you know, in this situation, I need to get out because, you know, they are with missing you and they love you and they're absolutely coming back for you. So that's what they are also saying. And they are also saying to you, we've had many lives together. It is, it's still not enough. So they're saying we've had lives together. They know that you've had lives together and they're saying it's still not enough. You know, they want more of that. Uh, they want to have that life with you. That's why they're saying to you, I'm absolutely coming back for you. They want to be with you in this lifetime. So that's the message that they have for you. So I'm being guided to keep going. So let's see what's coming through. We also have forever with you won't be long enough. So again, it's that same sort of message. We've had lives together. It's, it's, it still isn't enough. And they're saying forever with you won't be long enough. So they want, you know, it, it's just a way of saying that, you know, they want you to be with you, you know, for eternity, because forever it just won't be enough. It won't be long enough. It's just about that desire to be with you. That's what they're expressing with these two cards here. Just that deep desire to be with you there, Divine Feminine. 
And then we also have here, I want to make love to you. So they're wanting you to know as well that they're wanting to make love to you. They think about this. They miss you. They want to be with you. You know, they want to be with you physically to make love to you, but they also want to be around you. You know, that connection to talk to you, to be, you know, to, they miss the friendship. They miss everything about being with you. So that's what they are also saying. They're missing you physically as well. You know, we're saying, I miss you so much and I want to make love to you. I feel that this is something that is on their mind and they're thinking about as well at this time. And to finish off, the last message that they have for you is, I know you are frustrated with me. So they're saying, I know you're frustrated with me with the fact that I haven't moved forward. I haven't changed things just yet you know, and I'm still in the situation that I'm in or I haven't contacted you. I know you're frustrated with me, but I, they, I feel that they are also wanting you to know that, you know, in, with this message that they do realize that things are taking long or, you know, they haven't been in touch and they are saying, I know you're frustrated with me and they, they are wanting to change things and they feel bad about that, you know, about the way things are. And they're saying, I know you're frustrated with me. Uh, but it's also about remembering that, you know, it is part of the divine plan. Everything is exactly as it is meant to be. And, you know, and you may be a divine feminine who is frustrated. As I said, some of these messages may not relate to you and some may do. So I feel this is a message for some and not for others. There are some divine feminines who are frustrated with their divine masculine. And this is what's coming through. You know, they're saying, I know you're frustrated with me. And then, you know, and you're feeling like, why is it like this? Why aren't they not coming to me? And, and, you know, why are they not contacting me? Why did they leave me? And they're saying, I know you're frustrated with me. So they do feel that because you are one. And whatever you're feeling and the way you're, you know, thinking and the things that you are, you know, when you're in that frustration and at that anger, they feel that. So they're saying to you, I know you are frustrated with me. So I feel that this is a message for some. And, you know, and the message coming from the angels is about remembering that this journey is teaching you something as a divine feminine. You know, come back to yourself. See why you are having that frustration. Understand that this journey is there to help both of you grow. And, you know, the fact that you're not together at this time where you may be feeling frustrated with your divine masculine is all part of the divine plan. There are still things that need to happen when it comes to you, you know, healing that still needs to happen because this journey is teaching you to get to a place of unconditional love where you release that frustration and the anger and the, you know, all those um, so, sort of feelings of why are they doing this? And you come back to that place of that unconditional love. You work through it and you heal that and you come back to that place of unconditional love. Where you just love, you just have the love. You know, no matter where they are, what they are doing, you just have that love. That's what this journey is teaching you. So they are feeling it is what's coming through here. And they know that you are frustrated with them. If this is a message for you, you will know that. But those are the messages coming through for you that from them today. You know, they miss you so much. They're saying, I love you, baby. And I am absolutely coming back to you. And they are feeling you, you know, they feel so much about this connection, about the two of you being connected, even you, how you're feeling. That's why they're saying, I know you're frustrated. I feel so much, this much in separation. What will I feel in union? You know, and they are saying they are struggling with the fight where they are. This is what I feel like they, you know, they want to get out of that situation. They don't know how much they longer they can fight, you know, where they are and they just want to get out so that they can have the life that they truly desire. And, you know, and they want to be with you saying to you, you know, we've had many lives together. It still isn't enough forever. Won't be long enough. They just want that life with you and they're working towards that. So they are also saying to you, I want to make love to you. But the big message is they're missing you. That's what they wanted you to know today. And they're saying to you, I love you, baby. I hope you have a great day. Sending you so much love.